are going stand up paddle boarding out on this gorgeous spot. Oh, oh. That is epic. <laughs> Janae, how's your baby? Good. Is she coming with us to Aunt Shauna and Thomas' house? Yeah. <laughs> Once again, Thomas is baking. No, no, no. Elise. Yep. Elise is cooking for us. And what is this? Kaiser Schmarr. Kaiser Schmarr? Yeah. <laughs> and Shauna got to meet Lily. Yes. yes. Is she going to okay with it? Let me always have to watch for the head. The flipping. The Kaiser. Oh. Oh. Pretty good. Pretty good. Janae wanted Lily to have the chance to feed the turtles. Look, a baby. Yeah, these are the little guys. Yeah. Okay. Just be very level. Hold them levelly. They don't like to be like. I love watching so them. Cool. Yeah. Bite me. So look, if here's some more strawberries. Big mouth. Who knew these turtles would be this much fun? It smells like. Fluffy, comforting sweetness and butter. This one's for Caleb, the gluten free. Thank you so much. Here it is, the Kaiser Schmachen. Kaiser Schmachen. <laughs> it warms my heart so much that I made a special gluten free batch for Caleb. So they don't eat it with syrup. You eat it with powdered sugar. Thomas is going to show us how it's done. Oh, that's a great powdered sugar dispenser. What is this? Plums. Plums. Can you tell us what we're eating? Kaiserschmarrn. All right, can you okay, also say it in Bavarian? Kaiserschmarrn. <laughs> All right, let's hear it from okay. Shauna. Kaiserschmarrn. Okay, let's hear it. Kaiserschmarrn. Kaiserschmarrn. The Kaiserschmarrn. <laughs> no points for you. <laughs> Kaiserschmarrn. 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 Oh. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> okay. This is the coolest powdered sugar dispenser. We need this in the States. I feel like in the States when I'm trying to sprinkle, I just get poof. Like, a big bag of powdered sugar. in my face. This is very smart. This is something we could replicate at home. So we're doing the dishes after the amazing food. This is a feature that I have seen in Europe. In Sweden, we saw it. But it's on the sink where you have the drying rack. There's actually a drain right here. I love that. I've never seen that where I am have been in the States. I love all the different beautiful windows we're able to do dishes in front of. Yeah. Look at that. You can see Great down view. into the garden. It's beautiful. So we're driving along and we see this little like mini church on the side of the road. And Jeremy and Isaac were mentioning it and I said, Oh, well in Europe, like at least in the Germany, Austria, Switzerland area, they have like drive through churches basically, like smaller churches where you can like drive up and like you know, worship, and Jeremy started laughing, and I was like, why, why are you laughing? And he's like, oh, I thought you were joking, and I was like, no, I'm, I'm serious. And now, all of a sudden, I'm sitting here wondering. Is this Because do you know who taught me this? You're gonna- Grandma Chris? Grandma Chris? No. Grandpa Eric? Grandpa Eric taught me that. He probably taught you <laughs> something that wasn't real. <laughs> Just like you were, because what my, yes. I was joking and saying, our kids are someday gonna be like, yeah, and the drive through churches in Europe. <laughs> And just because you made this comment, but Grandpa Eric was so totally Now I have easy. to fact check him. We were up, I remember where we were. We were like up in the mountains in the Alps in either Switzerland or Austria, like near that border. And there was this little tiny church and he told me this whole story about it being in their church. And I'm gonna fact check this because Grandpa Eric would be cackling up in heaven right now <laughs> if he was pulling my leg all those years. He was always a jokester, always up for a good laugh. That's so funny. let's see. What do you drive think? Our drive-through churches, drive -through churches I mean, a real a thing. <laughs> I just don't know that we've become that convenient, you know, to follow the McDonald's model <laughs> with church. Well, and this was old. Like this would have been like a long time ago. Yeah. Okay, let's check it. This is proving to be a challenging question for Google. We're gonna have to ask Shauna and Thomas. Okay, so from my reading, roadside shrines are definitely a thing. Different than a drive through church. <laughs> it's true. So we're 
at a train stop waiting for the train to come. How many box cars, or what are they called? Just like 25. train carts? 12. I'm optimistic it'll be a short train. Uh, 19? I don't know, 20-ish. 64. 40. All right, we'll see. I'm gonna win. Oh, there's the train, count them. Oh, wow. One, two. <laughs> That was all? Who did you think was gonna win? 264. I lost. I that, won. That's I unusual. won. We were waiting for so long. I really was like building up for something big. And then two. Boom. Done. Got it done. We're on our way again. We think we're catching our first glimpse of the Alps ahead. There's like a bit of an outline. It's hard to see through the trees. We made it. How was your drive? Awesome, I read Alcatraz vs. the Evil Librarians by Brandon Sanderson the entire drive. It is so good. Nice. I love the parts where he like stops and, and like explains stuff in funny like ways. Yeah. I like the Yes, we brought the children to pump up the boards. J Janae's gonna do this one. Yeah. He's gonna pump this one up. You guys do this one. Keep going. <laughs> she did it. Good job, Elise. So I just asked Shauna about a drive-through church, and she looked at me. She goes. I've never heard of that in Germany ever, so I think Grandpa Eric was pulling my leg and I believed him for almost 30 years. <laughs> we are going stand up paddleboarding out on this gorgeous spot. Thomas is teaching them how to do it correctly. Today, <laughs> you're doing it. Today's getting cool. Go, Janae. I tried to help her and I pushed her in the water. I like was trying to make sure it wobbled and she fell in and she was not like that mom. <laughs> it's so beautiful out here. <laughs> Don't push me over. <laughs> 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 nice. Stand-up paddleboarding. Loved it. Loved it. And why are you all dressed with your jacket on now? Because it's cold. Aunt Shauna made me some tea. Yum. It's supposed to calm the time. Yeah. How was your time out on the water? 
It was fun. I it was more fun. It would be more fun if I had stayed dry as long as possible. <laughs> Did you get wet pretty it's, early on? Yeah. The drive here is beautiful. This lake is beautiful. It's so pleasant to swim in. It's not too cold. Like it is a little cold when you get in, but then it feels amazing. You're not cold until you get out and the breeze hits you. This weather here has been amazing. And the water just feels like clean and yeah, clear. Yeah, until you get out. Look. And then it's a little cold. Then you need your jacket, huh? Yeah. It's like pretzel bread. It is. Do you like it? Mm-hmm. It's really good. Mm -hmm. All right, bud, what do you think of stand-up paddle boarding? Super fun. Have you I done it before? It. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. There you go. You Can it. I try the next one? Yeah. I love my poncho. <laughs> That's awesome. I have it the orange. <laughs> <laughs> In the wind. <laughs> I love a good opportunity to be in my sweatshirt. This feels so cozy. So right here on the lake, there is a little restaurant. We're about an hour and a half from where we're staying, so we're gonna grab some french fries right here. So technically we wanted a little pose. A pose? Yeah. Okay. So this is a three, two, one. <laughs> So southern Germany is referred to as Bavaria and the Alps are right back there and the, the day is cleared up where we can really see it well. We're taking some Way pictures. Off camera. All of this beauty just doesn't look the same on camera. Here's the beautiful pictures that Isaac has been taking. They're point fives. <laughs> <laughs> it's of Caleb. <laughs> That's Caleb. <laughs> There you go. So it's been fun today to do the paddle boarding, the jumping off of the diving board, swimming in the lake. But the best part has been just sitting on the blankets and talking with family. That is epic! Very satisfying. <laughs> it is. Really cool. Exactly. So. Oh, I see. There's an art to this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you do it awesome. I love this <laughs> What you do is you go sideways. So. That is so cool. Yeah, I like mesmerize. We've been doing this for a really long time. I got it. I did it. Jeremy's still getting adjusted to this vehicle. After like seven minutes of trying That's to okay. get out. Good night. Out. <laughs> you have a clubhouse? Wonderful to have a local who can show us around. There it is. 